Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome back to another video. So before I do start this video, I just want to tell you guys this is not 100% true. This is just rumors and leaks. So uh, this is not 100% true. Um, so this is uh, finally uh, NHL 18 news. We're going to go to this video. Yo guys, what is up everybody? It is Paddock Kills. You're welcome back to a brand new video. I'm so excited because we have NHL 19 news finally. I mean, NHL 18, I don't know how it's been for you guys. It's kind of been a, a bit of a weird year for me. I started playing the game, then I stopped playing because of Fortnite, and I'm kind of getting back into it. I'm just like, playing some game mode now. I doubt we'll make an NHL 19 wish list, but one thing I'm really hopefully they do add is uh, maybe like custom rosters. That's one thing I want them to add. But let's just go right in this video. So I'll leave the link down in the description. I want to give a huge credit to Thrash9 for gaming. Uh, I was on YouTube today and just watched his video. And I saw that uh, his video. So I'm just going to leave his, uh, the original video of his down below in the description. Uh, I was I, like, I found out because of him. But I'm just going to give you guys my thoughts on this. So, okay. So basically, there's a bunch of stuff here uh, we're going to be talking about. Uh, some of these are pretty cool. Um, Collision physics. Um, This is just with NHL 3s, uh, which... It's pretty good. I mean, it says, um, you know, here's like the little, you know, description. Big hits, one-on-one -on -one battles, and stick-on-stick -stick collisions throughout the game and in NHL 3s. Big hits are more satisfying than ever. So I think it's just going to do about hits. Scouting uh, for, like, franchise mode. The franchise mode scouting has been overhauled to add a new layer of depth and strategy to scouting. Hire the right scouts to determine the priorities and evaluate expectations with a wealth of info to make the best choice in drafting. I love this. Like... I think the scouting assignment in NHL 18 or just in like the franchise mode is completely unnecessary and it's just annoying. I feel like um, you should be able to hire scouts and then you should just tell them like uh, throughout the year, uh, like this month, you just like do all the scouting in the beginning of the year. So like we're near in the season, that little annoying pop up doesn't have to come up. So I think that's one thing they should definitely add here. So uh, that's definitely one thing I like that they're adding because it's just so annoying. I, hopefully like... You can just hire the scouts and, and just do like the scouting assignment in the beginning of the year. So like in the middle of the year and when you're like simulating, it doesn't have to come up. Next up, we have power-ups uh, power in NHL 3. So basically, I think this is like when uh, the description, activate temporary power-ups in NHL 3 for even a more action, shrink, or freeze in the op opposition and add rocket skates, giant goalies, and much more. So I think this is in NHL 3s. Uh, you can get power ups. You can get giant goalies. I think this is like referring back to like the uh, three on three arcade NHL games back in the day. So I'm actually definitely really excited for this. NHL threes was a pretty cool game one at the beginning of the year. I don't really think anybody even plays it anymore because I I know I don't like I don't even touch it. UGC customization tools to create and share your own custom designs for gear, rings, uniforms, goalie mic, and more. Browse select from the other players' creations. I love this EA thank you hopefully this is in the game I think this means customization so EA sports I think this is the tools to customize designs for gears ranks uniforms goalie mask and more or browse and select from player creations all right this is what I want I, this is a good idea but I want them to add custom rosters like if you don't play if you don't know NBA 2k NBA 2k they have custom rosters and those rosters like and that's like it would just make the community much better like I'm like you know how everyone tries to make those videos, what if videos, like, can, you know, 36 overalls win the Stanley Cup or something. Um, I like to make these kind of videos, like, what if videos, like, what if this trade didn't happen, what if, you know, this. Hopefully they can add custom rosters into the game, like NBA 2K, and there'll be so much play, uh, fun playing franchise mode. I think that'd be amazing. So hopefully, you know, this customization does come in the game. Hopefully they add that. Like, I've been asking for custom rosters for so long now. Hopefully they do add it. The greatest of all time teams. I'm excited for this. 500 NHL Legends brings the life, uh, life, the history of the NHL. And lets you play with all time teams and and add legends to your hut team and lock them in NHL threes. Uh, I know this is another thing NB2K has. Um, all time teams where you can play with legends. So I'm definitely excited about this. You can add these legends to your hut team. You can play with these in like I think play now or something, and you can unlock them uh, in NHL threes. I definitely love this man. This is gonna be amazing. This need to add a bunch of stuff, um, and I'm really excited for this stuff. Uh, World of Chell, play and complete with your created player in many modes, either offline or online, competitive, uh, recognition 3 and 3, it's free for all, and more where you're choosing your link. I think this is be a pro or something, maybe, like, I don't know, uh, all the eSports games have, like, a story mode, like, a story mode game, so hopefully, like, be a pro is, I think this might be be a pro, um, I just think BM Pro is so boring. Hopefully they can add like a, just a little bit. I mean, this looks pretty interesting. You can play and compete and get uh, achievements and progression, which is pretty cool. I'm just looking for like a BM Pro game mode. 
Chow rivalry challenges connect, compare, and compete with friends, whether they're offline or uh, online. Compete with your friends to set records, streaks, take down their high scores, and bring life to every action. So I, th I think this is um, what was I think it was like superstar challenges back in actual 16, 15, or fourteen, where you do like this moment or something. I think this is that, but this time your friends, uh, you can go for records. So that's pretty cool. New 3's campaign, more action rewards faster than ever. Each game features a unique challenge of a superstar player, personality, and legend boss battles. Play through the campaign to unlock rewards in Hockey Ultimate Team. I like this idea. So, you basically uh, play through the 3's campaign and you get rewards in Hockey Ultimate Team. I definitely love that idea. Real player movement tech. So, they said that they're going to be adding more uh, like realistic movement to f fluidity, skating, shooting, passing, physics that make the game look modern and the strategy and how you play the game. I like that. Chell rank, an achievement track system that recognizes your accomplishments and rewards you will unlock with player traits, specifics, and gear to show off your status, which is pretty cool. New broadcast presentation, cutting edge presentation package that gives you more insight and interaction that's what's possible on TV, then even includes more insights into the science of sport. They need to change up the uh, broadcaster thing and new commentators. Okay, I like this. A new commentary team that brings you closer to the action than ever before the new commentary. Uh, yeah, they gotta add new commentary, man. I'm tired. Like, as much as I love. You know, the commentaries, they're just, like, you can tell, like, they just recycle the commentary year after year. And next up, this is really interesting. Be a superstar game mode. So, be a superstar game mode. Uh, Non-linear narrative driven by personal choice and performance for your single. Be a pro career with somatic scenes. Compelling s stills. Yo. EA. EA Sports. What? This is crazy. Be a superstar game mode. Oh, my God. This is what we need. This is the best. Yo, cinematic scenes, compelling narrative audio, text-based decisions, and legendary cameos. Yo, EA Sports. This is what we need. EA, man. Be a superstar game or I am just... Guys, I, if this is actually going to be in the game, I'm going to be super excited for this. I swear to God. I will be amazing. I'll be super excited for this, man. Hopefully this is in the game. Uh, EA, you got to add this in the game because this is what Be A Pro is missing. Be A Pro is just so boring. You look at like, you look at FIFA, they got the journey. You look at even NBA 2K's career mode's pretty fun. This is definitely, I mean, they just add Be A Superstar game mode. I mean, that's already like, Be A Pro, it just sounds like dumb. Be A Superstar sounds way better, so... Dude, I love this, man. Hopefully, this is in the game. Tell me you guys' thoughts in the comment section below about this game mode, man. Like, the the, uh, the description of this game mode is already amazing. I already love this, uh, in my opinion. So, that's everything that will be here. I mean, my favorite part about this uh, would be scouting. Um, you know, I think scouting, custom UGC customization would be amazing. Um, and obviously, be a superstar. I mean, everything here looks amazing, if I'm going to be honest with you guys. I just think some of this might be boring, like NHL 3s, I don't think, like, it depends what the rewards are going to be, because the rewards are always so bad, like, I think, like, the rewards for draft champions were, like, an 80, 86 player, and I don't think that's even that good, so the rewards need to be better, I don't even think they're going to be good, so I think the NHL 3s, again, is going to be dead, and hopefully they do add custom rosters, man, I really want them to add custom rosters to the game, hopefully that does uh, come into the game, and hopefully they do add, like, um better draft champion rewards and just make draft champions better like you got to make draft champions better in my opinion and I, I i personally can't wait i mean you should look at nba 2k like my league dude nba 2k is so fun with like the my league and stuff hopefully they, like they, they take some of that customization with like custom rosters all-time rosters and they add that into uh chell which would be amazing like imagine like i can't wait for nhl 19 it's gonna be amazing hopefully it's a better year than this year um I mean, I already have a lot of great ideas for NHL 19 in my brain that I'm just going to keep for NHL 19. So, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video, guys. Um, before I do end up this video, I do have another video releasing uh, soon. I don't know if I'm going to upload this. I don't know if it's already uploaded or if it's uploading tomorrow. But uh, it is five players will be trading the offseason. I'm making a bunch of videos, uh, real-life NHL videos, talking about players, which players do I think will be moved. So, hopefully you guys will enjoy this video. Now... Quick fact, I just got a uh, vote thing. So, Matthew Barzell, Brock Besser, and Clayton Keller are the 2017 Calder Specialists. So, 
Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did drop a like, subscribe to the channel. And you guys and remember go check out Thrash Line for